Now, they've been called a national treasure and have been loved by Kiwis across the country since their first stage show 20 years ago. Now they are teaming up with leading Pacific Theatre company, The Conch, for the Auckland Arts Festival. This means we have another chance to see the Naked Samoans live on stage. Would you please welcome to the cafe, Hito and Shimpao. Yes. Thank you for having us. Such an honour. Awesome. Awesome. Such an honour. National treasure. Wow. wow. <laughs> what the? Look mean, at that bloom. It doesn't mean you're old. Is that what happens? Oh, yeah. So yeah. Exactly. yeah, that's right. <laughs> Well, well, it's true. <laughs> yeah, we're up You are? No, no, but you've been doing this a while. But um, how did you guys get together in the first place 20 uh, years ago? We were all in Wellington. Me, David Fane, uh, Mario Ngawa and Oscar Kali were all sort of working the traps down in Wellington. Uh, 90s. And, um, yeah, it was just that sort of thing of, um, you know, we weren't getting enough work, so why not let's make our own work? And so we got together and wrote some jokes and put a story, put it in a story, and the Naked Samoans were born. And as we said, a national treasure. And, and Hito, you joined a little later on, once they first joined. Um, but when you guys got together this time round, 20 years later, right. Robbie Mangasiva was telling us it was a little bit difficult to get everybody together. He had to hire a house, he had to bribe Did us he? a little. Wow. Yeah, he uh, was Robbie and telling stories. <laughs> <laughs> but I think he's referring to we had like a, we had because this show we wrote ourselves. We started from scratch with the story and everything. So of course um, the writing process took a bit of a toll. And uh, Robbie suggested we go away for a weekend. Yeah, we went to Matakana for yeah. three days <laughs> to try and finish the script. <laughs> and, did and, you? And, yeah, did yeah. you? How did that go? Uh, ask Robbie. <laughs> 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 how that story ends. But yeah, we've got a show. We've got a show and we're opening tomorrow night. So, um, yeah, the weekend worked somehow. Uh, yeah. And Hito, tell us about it. I mean, what can we expect in the show? Because, you know, there's a lot of play on the word magic. Yes, there is. It, it's, it's very physical. We're working wow. with, uh, collaborating with The Conch. Uh, wonderful directors, uh, Tom McCrory and Nina Nawalawala. And Nina has 10 years experience in magic. So it was a natural progression to, to include magic. And we've been training for the past year. We had to, well, I had to lose weight and get fit. There are, there are tricks that I really want to talk about, but come and watch the show and you'll be amazed. Yeah, that's oh, real, so they are actually tricks. Yeah, 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 we, we had to All the way from Las magic. Vegas. All the way from Las Vegas, we had like <laughs> yeah. magic consultants come and teach us, you know, how no to work way. fingers, uh, how to. Yeah. yeah. It's proper real magic. Yeah. Because yeah. I was thinking that it was magic as in spellbinding, you no. know, but there's actual magic. Yeah, oh, yeah, okay. yeah. No, okay, it's nice. all, it's, it's, it's the real. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but still, the magic's only like a part of it because it's, it's essentially it's we're trying to tell story. a story. Yeah. Right. You know, sort of thing. Yeah. So magic's just one of the layers along yeah. with the lights, along with the script, along with the choreography. So it starts, doesn't it, with uh, someone dying and leaving you a house? Sione in... Dini. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Sione Dini. Houdini? In to be. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's the sort of frame we've built this yeah. story around. But essentially, the story is it's about it's about hope, you know, right. sort it of is. thing. Because it is. Um, contrary, hope that you can get a house in Auckland. Yeah, well, yeah. Hope, yeah, well, hopefully we can get sell some tickets, <laughs> <laughs> sort of thing. But yeah, because um, our stuff, contrary to popular belief, you know, poos and wees on Bro Town and yeah. all that sort of stuff, we are quite layered sort of thing. He's dead and poos and wees. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> there's all that there as well. <laughs> <laughs> but the climate of the time, sort of, we made us look around and go, like, you know, what's happening with our society, what's happening with our mm. communities mm. and stuff, and let's um, try and tell a story that's going to pick us all up, because it's always been about all of us. Yeah. All of us. All of us. <laughs> I get the sense that you guys, you know, on stage, there's a lot of laughs, and when you're yes. on a show like this, there's a lot of fun. But um, I, you guys take this quite seriously, don't you, Hito? Oh, yeah, we have yeah. to. Within the show, we're playing ourselves in an alternate, alternate reality. Right. So what if... It didn't work out 20 years ago, and so that's what we're exploring. Yeah, we well, lost hope. Professor X and the X-Men. Yeah. You know, that sort of... Oh, deep. There you go. Now, I read somewhere as well that potentially this could be your last show. I mean, it's taken you 12 years to do another show. Why would it, it be your last? last show, isn't it? Why? Because um, theatre is so physically demanding. Yeah. Every time you step on the stage, it could be your last show. <laughs> <laughs> and National Treasures end up with the museum eventually, yeah. don't they? <laughs> but mostly it's... Um, Gout. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We call them murmurs for this sort of things. But yeah, this is, uh, part of being a big group is that everyone's doing different stuff all the time. So to get mm, everyone long enough together to, you know, do some work. Yeah, yeah, exactly. And what else have you been up to? Ah, 
Oh, bits and pieces, because people have always been asking us, you know, like, um, why get back together now? Like, yeah. we've been apart, but we actually haven't been apart. We've, you know, done a couple of movies, TV series, boys have gone off and done all that sort of things, and we do a few other projects sort of behind the scenes as well, and, you know, just sort of surviving in the game, to, sort of really. We were catching up for a drink. I catch it. <laughs> <laughs> coffee, coffee. coffee drink. And, and I heard a rumour too that there could be a Brotown movie. Yeah, that's a rumour. Oh, you're pointing at me, pointing at me. Uh, oh, yes, that's true. We've been working on the Brotard movie ever since the series sort of finished, so we're right. up to our draft 765th <laughs> draft. So it's it's, yeah, it's going to um, be good. What it actually is, is that we've been given development to finish writing the scripts. So wow, that's where awesome. we're at. So we're, the movie might or still might not happen, but we're at the stage of trying to finish the script. And, so, and, and you know, just, just quickly, uh, did you see the Naked Samoans before you joined them, or did you join them with I saw scene? them 20 years ago. Right. Well, yeah, I was in Bats in the audience watching these guys be it, it was hilarious. And you loved it? And then I got a phone call in 2000, hey, uh, Hits, it was Oscar, Hits, uh, we need a Tokelau and Dancer, you know. <laughs> so and then Slash I was on the show, dancer, yeah, break dancer. Right. I didn't know you were a break dancer. I, I'm not, anyway. No, no, no. no. Oh, I think you were broken. Oh, yes, we were That's in the show as well. That's oh, is it? Okay. Yeah, that's, okay. The show's massive because the Conch um, Theatre Company from Wellington, they're sort of a visual, you know, um, massive sets, awesome lights, you know, as well yeah. as tricks and everything. Whereas Naked Star Wars, we just come from a black stage wow. sort of thing. So we're learning all that. But some of the stuff the Conch have been pulling out, apart from the magic, has been just freaking amazing. Yeah, we stand back amazing. and go, wow, we're in this. <laughs> so oh, back to work. Yeah. <laughs> so it's taking it to the next level, which is why we should go and see this show. Yeah, yeah. which is why they needed the huge, majestic Civic, Civic. Theatre oh, to put it in. Brilliant. It's going to yeah. look amazing. Fun, Can't magic, wait. awesomeness. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. And the Naked Samoans Do a Magic is on Auckland Civic Theatre, as you just heard from the guys. From tomorrow until Friday, check out the Auckland Arts Festival or Ticketmaster website for detail. Thanks so much, guys, yeah, for coming guys. in. Yeah, Should we have some chicken now? Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs>